Okay, as promised, uh, it's been two weeks since my last post. I sent it up into the ash tree, the backyard, the one remaining ash tree in Michigan. And I seen some signs and some symptoms that kind of made me nervous. Um, first, I did locate uh, some area, which I'll show real quick. Uh, it looks to be uh, some woodpecker damage starting to happen up in the canopy again. Uh, what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to continue to narrate, but I'm going to kind of see if I can zoom in on a, on a couple of these areas that would be a sign that uh, it's possible that this tree is getting reinfested. Uh, again, it's been a while. Uh, I don't. I can't even tell you the exact date that I treated this tree. It's probably seven, eight years ago, maybe even plus. But um, trying to see how long it takes before uh, this tree will get reinfested. So. Uh, Hold on one second, I'm gonna spin this around and I'll be right back. Up in the tree, you can see the buds. They're starting to swell, maybe a little, little having trouble picking that up, but let me see if I can pan out on something different and pick that bud up. As you can see, it's trying to pick everything else up but that bud. But the buds are starting to swell, it's starting to come alive. But some of the problems of things is right there. That's last year woodpecker damage. Could have been from larva from last year. Uh, I go up a little bit farther. You can kind of see some woodpeckering holes right here. And what kind of gave it away is some of the flaking of the bark. Uh, we come back around to this side of the bowl. Right there. That was a pretty good one I seen. You can actually see a little bit of gallery and some frass inside of this hole right here. So I can continue to wait. There's some old damage. Um, I don't see any de-exit holes anywhere. So it could tell me here's some old gallery, some old damage, uh, some more old damage on this lead. But again, no fresh de-exit holes. So which means that um, it's slowly starting to become reinfested. So, um, kind of a view from the top. Looking around, you can actually see across the street, uh, maples are starting to swell up. Um, I got some elms over there to check. The creek looking good. Okay, so I kind of showed you the canopy. I said I'm about 30, 40 feet up. Uh, this is the ash that I showed a video of me front in front of before. So there is signs now that this tree, after seven, eight, nine plus years, uh, is getting reinfested. So I'm gonna slate this for treatment this year. Um, as soon as these leaves pop out, uh, I'll, uh, I'll videotape the treatment. So uh, Arbor Jet Joe from the Canopy uh, talking about EAB and an ash tree that hasn't been treated in a while. Looks like we're gonna have to treat her soon. So stay tuned for more on Emerald Ash Borer Ash Trees in Michigan. Talk to you soon, bye.